Hey guys, Mechanic CG here and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport. Today is episode number 46. If you guys do enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and let's get into the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. Alright, so we're here at the classic sports car endurance event. 22 laps around Mazda Raceway Laguna Seca. And uh, our only option really is a Ford GT40. The other cars are just too slow for this event. Let's get going. All right, this is it. Let's get going. Time for the Ford GT to spread its wings and show the world what it's made of. And also to try and beat that goddamn Ferrari in front. I realize... Oh, I've gone into reverse. <laughs> We've pulled that off, though. All right. This is going to be quite difficult. So this is going to be 22 laps of uh, what is hell. Holy shit. It's a bloody fast car this is. We're going to see quite a few lapped cars, I believe, because those cars behind, um, they're like A-class, B-class kind of things. That Ferrari is going to be on my ass for a while. And I'm going to have to stay focused for a while as well. So the aim is to get up to lap 11 before needing to pit. I think I will just end up pitting on lap 11 because it's the easiest way of doing it. I know this car has a slightly longer range fuel tank, I believe. So fuel probably won't be an issue. But tire wear 100% will be. Oh dear. Here we go. Whoa! Here we go. We lost... The rear of the car was sliding a little... 
I think we've got distance now, actually. If I'm not mistaken, I think the Ferrari made a bit of a cock up. Which gives us a little bit of safety. We're obviously not out of the woods, but a little bit of safety is always greatly appreciated. The thing is, those air scoops for the engine, I can only imagine that they produce a small amount of lift because of the way that they're angled. Oh, we got this. Already starting to catch up, though, slowly to the uh, back markers up there. I doubt the cars behind will start becoming back markers for us, but I know that these cars in front are going to possibly get lapped once, even twice, maybe. Yes, sure. <laughs> Cheers for reminding me of that clip. It's brilliant. I like to play with my penis. <laughs> Such a brilliant clip, though. I know, which means it's become, I think, second most viewed on my channel, that clip, which is not too bad, and which also means it's going to be featured on my Be Right Back screen as well, so I will check it after this race, take about 25-30 minutes. There you go, not too bad. A uh, little bit tail happy. I hate the fact that you can just straight up shift into reverse in this game. Seems a little bit stupid. Right, bank markers. Hello there.
I think that's an Alpine. Either an Alpine or a Ferrari Dino. One or the other. It's actually quite difficult to tell what car's what in this game. <laughs> that was a good bit of a tactical sliding from the rear of my car there. Tactical downshift, didn't come in. You seen at the yes, what the fuck is that? I think it's a Porsche up ahead. It is a Porsche up ahead. Oh, wow, okay, that was a save and a half. Oh, what, the clip, yeah. That's, uh, clip's done pretty well, to be honest. Bing, 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 bing. Bing, 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 bing. Uh, I've got no clue yet. I think it updates once a week, maybe. So, we'll try it after this race. Because after this race, I'm going to run downstairs quickly. So, we'll try the Be Right Back screen and see if it pops up. I hope it does, because it was uh, <laughs> quite a scuffed... Uh... I haven't got a drink. That's why I need to go downstairs to get one. Holy shit balls. <laughs> Wait, you just wasted your channel points because I'm not drinking. <laughs> See, that damn muscle car in front is the one that we'd normally have to use for all the other sports car events. Classic sports cars. Oh, what are you doing? Get out of the way. Get out of the way! Come on, move. Oh, my... God. There's a reason why I hate that muscle car. Is because every single time the AI drives it, the AI is just utter shit. Yeah, you better yield your position, prick. Get out of the way. It's fine. We can take a little bit of transmission damage. That's our car behind. We need to try and avoid letting overtake us. Whoa! 
whoa, 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 whoa. See, we could actually do this without taking a pit stop. Actually, no, we can't. We've done 10 laps, and we're just over half a tank, so we would still need to pit. Oh, that fucking Ferrari's on my ass now. Now, the one thing I'm hoping is that by taking an early pit stop, the car behind is actually going to start running on slower tires. That's the only thing I can hope for. There we go. We're in the pits. What is Bonetto sent me then? Let's have a look at this quick. Imagine boosting a Reddit post. <laughs> That's kind of funny. All right, we're in third place. I don't like that, but we'll take it. Great, I'm behind these two fuckheads again. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Lovely. Whoa! Oh, I managed to pull that off just about, but fuck. That was too sketchy. The only thing is, the Ferrari is going to have better tyres on its last stint, obviously. But it will be running a majority of its time on more worn tyres, so... No, 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 no.
So that's the other Ford in front. And the car beyond that is the Ferrari. Oh my god, the Ferrari's been here! No way! Oh my god, that's so lucky. What the hell? The Ferrari has absolutely been there. Oh my god. We witnessed that Ferrari absolutely die then. So it looks like the Ferrari's continuing its laps, but the Ford has gone into the pits. So we should, as long as we can keep the Ferrari behind, then we're going to be fine for the rest of the race. We are looking pretty good. I'm enjoying this drum and bass here. Drum and bass from good old 2014. I need to find a um old drum and bass playlist filled with songs from like 2006 to 2010 because that was the best era of drummer bass in my opinion the only thing is the audio quality was never that high so you never had a high quality listening experience there was just there was just a different charm with drum and bass back in that era Green Porsche looking thing is in front of us. Is that a, oh, that's the Ferrari in the pits. Ferrari is in thy pit lane. Oh, and we're running at half speed at the moment. And that's a Ferrari out of the pits. So we have approximately... 25, 30 second advantage. That should be enough for six laps. Even if we're lo losing one second a lap. Car behind, 28.5 seconds. Yeah. So we just got to keep an eye on that car behind thing. And as long as every time it pops up, it's not a second. So it's 28.7 the last time. Let's see what it says this time. Twenty-seven point five. Ooh. 
Ouch. But I did have that Porsche to overtake because, again, it's still 27.5. Oh, I got hiccups. Seven point two. Still looking good. I'm gonna try and keep it away from the single digits, like seconds in single digits. See, there is strategy with Forza. It's pit on the halfway mark. Holy smokes. There's a car heading into the pits now, so... Twenty six point eight. Still all right, actually. The only thing is, our tyres are going to start wearing out at about lap 20, so potentially could see that difference. Because at the moment, it's going down by about 0.1 second a lap. We could see that climb. I'm sorry, where were my brakes then? I believe that's all of the cars have pitted now, so the last four laps we shouldn't have any lag whatsoever. Oh dear. That's lost me a huge chunk of time. Car behind is 24 seconds as well, so that's going to be about uh, 16. Pretty fucking solid guess, if I do say so myself. <laughs> uh, not too much, Pandy, not too much. Just uh, me spinning out. That was a pretty fucking solid guess. I will, I will admit that. I'll take full credit. That car in front caused an absolute 
ball like trying to get past it. Ah, fair enough, Bandy. Fair enough. Get out of the way. Stop hogging the road, you prick. Unfortunately, the faster cars get priority on the racetrack. That is the rules of motorsport. That is the rules. It is driving etiquette. If you cannot follow driving etiquette, you should not be on a racetrack. Woo! You big summer blowout. <laughs> Alright, this is the penultimate lap. I've actually gained time. We went from 16.2 to 17.6. Somehow. Not too bad. All right, coming on to the final lap now. zombie apocalypse broke out, my town would be screwed. On my street alone, there's two to three graveyards. Bloody hell. That's, uh, that's pretty crazy, actually. Oh, it's this guy again. Get off the track. Move! Oh, I've hit the number three board. And now I've got a uh, aggressive muscle car. Dive bombing it up the inside. Still 17 seconds the car behind though, so... And uh, there we go. That is it. 33-37. Not too bad for that race. Uh, 121 grand because we got shit tons of damage. And uh, I believe there's a car for us. The Ferrari. Cheers. Appreciate it. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.
Thank <laughs> you.